And uh, yeah, as you can see, that fresh ass windshield, clean as fuck, bro. Like, it's so fucking clean. Like, when I was looking at it, I was like, oh my gosh. Like, why didn't I do this before? Just because it's so clean. Alright, so what is going on, guys? We are back at it again with another video. And it's been about a week and a half. Sorry about the delay, but I just really didn't have that much content to film. Right now, I'm currently about to get a windshield replaced on my E36. Check it out so you guys can see why I'm replacing it. Hold on, this is huge ass van fucking passing by. Thanks a lot. Anyways, this is crack right here. I don't know if you can see it because the sun and the balancing and all that stuff. I'm pretty sure you can, but I'm getting that replaced. Plus, I have like plastic dip and shit on it. So I just really just want to get rid of it so I can have a fresh windshield on it. My banner, I'm going to be doing again. I'm going to try to do it better too. I'll probably get a different colorway as well. I still have not fixed my, uh, my, my my uh, hood because my hood has like this white cast over it as you can see it looks really bad sorry i literally just woke up so that's why i can't explain shit that very well but uh, yeah so that's pretty much what's been going on i've been super busy working so i just really didn't have much time to film and edit and to have everything done like that but stay tuned for more content i will be buying coilovers pretty soon probably next week or this week i'm not sure whenever i get around to do it so that should be awesome and i still have not done the hydro e but wait on it it's gonna be sick and guess what guys i might have to buy lsd because i think we fucked up for the welded diff because i can hear it popping but i think it's actually like the pieces are like coming out i'm pretty sure the welds are like breaking free so that sucks but if it does break free when i'm on the highway or something i'm pretty much fucked but it is what it is guys this is what happens when you try to build a drift car anyways so stay tuned for that and i might have a fucked up weld to diff pretty soon so that might be another video but for right now let's get it and let's go all right guys i'm back just finished the whole process it took about an hour and uh yeah i didn't pretty much film anything because i didn't see the point of filming inside the store in front of people's faces and stuff like that but i do have a fresh windshield costs about 178 bucks so that's fucking awesome lifetime warranty shout out to auto glass and uh, yeah, I'm just gonna keep these tapes on for about a day or so. Fuck it, why not? They actually put new of these like little emblems. I don't know what the fuck they're called. Sorry for the sound, but um, they put new. They put fresh one of these. I sound like an idiot right now. And uh, yeah, it looks fucking mint. It looks way better, honestly. And uh, yeah, I'm pretty hyped on it. I'm gonna get a new banner, of course, and uh, fix this fucking ugly ass fucking hood. That'll be the next fucking project. And uh, it's on the hydro, and honestly, I've been thinking about painting the car red, so it should be fucking mint if I do. I'm not too sure if I should or not, or wrap it, but it should come out sick either way. I might just wrap it either like red, or just paint it red, or like an M3 color, so it should be fucking mint. But I'm probably going to clean up my car and wrap up this video. Just wanted to show you guys that I do have a little bit of stuff that I am still doing with this car. It's just right now, I've been so busy that I can't really do anything, so... That's kind of been my, my big hunch, but I will be putting out more content soon, so stay tuned for that. There's a big ass bird trying to dive in, oh my God. All right guys, right now I'm just waiting for these cars to finish up. I'm about to clean out my car. It's back to being dirty as fuck again. I don't know why my car stays dirty, guys. Like legit, it stays dirty. Like I'm such a mess. I need somebody to like just clean out my car every week. Just like clean my car out every fucking week. I pay like 20 bucks an hour or something like that. No, not an hour, like a session. I don't fucking know. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna clean it out this time. Hopefully, I'm gonna just keep it clean. I've been thinking about keeping like a trash bag or something in my car just because I'm so fucking messy. But I don't know, we'll fucking know. I've been messy since I was a kid though. So like, this is not like some little like, I don't know. Like I've been messy since I was a kid, guys. So I don't really know what the fuck is going on with me. But anyways, I'm gonna clean out my car. And uh, yeah, two cars are coming out. So sorry for the isolation being so high. You probably can't see the cars. But anyways, I'm gonna hurry up and go. So yeah. Ah, I'm out. Alright guys, so here's a better look at it. Just cleaned out the car for the most part. I still have like a lot of like, oh shit, I'm stepping on my headphones. Wow. I still have like a lot of junk and stuff that like I have in my car, like my drill and like some of my jackets and like windshield wipers, my skateboard and stuff like that. But other than that, for the most part, everything's cleaned out. Still have to do like the exterior wise. I'm honestly thinking about painting it and stuff like that, but 
I'm getting that in the mail. Order from China. It's fucking taking forever, dude. Do not order nothing from China unless you have to. Because China takes way longer than what they really have to, guys. I've ordered stuff from China, and it took like a week. I got other stuff from China. It took like three months. So it's like, it really is like off the charts when it comes to this shit. But anyways, I'm trying to get this hood fucking fixed, guys. Like, even though a lot of people say it's not that bad, and some people actually say they like it a lot, I don't. So I'm going to fix it. I'm going to get that cleaned out because that one's way too clean. This one's fucking dirty. And uh, yeah, as you can see, that fresh ass windshield, clean as fuck, bro. Like, it's so fucking clean. Like, when I was looking at it, I was like, oh my gosh. Like, why didn't I do this before? Just because this is so clean. But everything's good and everything's straight, guys. I'm pretty happy and pumped on uh, how my car is getting so far. I mean, it's still in the beginning stages and I, this channel is like growing pretty slowly and I haven't really been putting out the producing content, my short films like I want to, but let it be known guys, trust me, I'm probably gonna have one of the best edits on YouTube when it comes to making like car videos, like short films and stuff like that guys. I'm gonna bring it to the next level, mark my words. I know this sounds very bigotry, which is not the right word for it, cocky or anything like that, but just trust me when I say I can edit really good. It's gonna be fucking sick. So stay tuned for that. I'm gonna have drones, I'm gonna have hella shit, I'm gonna have other car YouTubers and stuff like that and then maybe other car car guys in the but anyways, sorry for the wind. I already know it sounds windy as fuck. But as you can see, this is it, guys. This is probably a wrap for this video. And uh, yeah, guys, stay tuned for more content. Just cleaned out my car. So today was a pretty good day for me. But I go to work at like 4 o'clock. So yeah, I'm just rambling right now. But I'm in this video right about now. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you guys enjoyed my life, everything I've been going on. Thank you for all the subscribers. Thank you for the love and support. Migos is playing in the back. I love that fucking song. But anyways, as always, stay sleepy, guys. We're out. Ugh. Yo, I had to use fucking penetrating oil, bro, but I fucking finally got it out, man. This thing's heavy.